guys welcome back to my channel as you can tell at the beginning of the video I have a little clip for you guys um, of uh, how I do my nails and stuff but that's just a little clip for now uh, I want to start this video um, as a new um, videos on my channels this will be my second video talking about nails um, in general like how I do my nails and nail polish and what type of nail polishes I, ref uh, I prefer and stuff like that um, I believe I have a, a nail polish video up two years ago and that's my SC um, haul review swatches and stuff like that and I'll have the link down below for you guys to see that I will name that will be my first um, nails uh, part one and that's a nail segment that's this is what I'm gonna call and this is part two and today uh, well because I filmed a really long video of talking about my favorite nail polishes and um, my favorite top coat base coat and stuff like that and I also do um, I film uh, how I do my nails I didn't want to combine it together because that's just way too long so I went ahead and um, you know have um, did that and I will post that up uh, after I post this video up and it's gonna be so it's gonna be a continuance of um, this videos so you guys gonna see that little sneak peek in the another video but for today um, before I get started excuse me I am in my PJ it's a Saturday morning I'm, I'm very lazy I didn't want to wake up this morning I was oh man so so tired but um, I get a chance to film because I sent Sunny out to run some errand for me and stuff like that and now I'm free to film before I have to leave uh, to Boston so um, uh, excuse me uh, in my onesie and I am drinking my coffee mm. anywho I'm gonna start it um, out with um, my polishes and here's I have a few in my hands the reason why I have a few is I'm gonna show you guys um, this two nail polish right here as you can tell is the um, blue shade this first one this uh, royal blue is called but butler please and this is number 819 uh, 819 I love and adore this color a lot um, I have so much compliment wearing this color it's just a true uh, blue royal blue color and I just love it it's a creamy um, finish I don't know. I have been wearing this color a lot. I'm very obsessed with it. I see this um, particular color in store all over uh, drugstore, CVS, Walmart, Walgreens, and stuff. So you guys can't um, still pick it up. And I love love this color. I highly recommend it. Just make my nails really beautiful. And trust me, you will get a lot of compliment um, when you wear this. And then the next color. Um, the reason why I mentioned them because a lot of you guys asked me what color I have on my nails in my last uh, video which is my drugstore um, haul video and in, on my Instagram so I might as well mention to them and they are my favorite they probably will make it into my um, monthly favorite so I just wanted to tell you guys that now and then the second favorite um, of the moment I like I said I just have this in my um, previous video and this is where is my chauffeur um, 818 and this uh, color as well you can get it in um, the drugstore I see it all over the drugstore so still can pick it up love love this color it's beautiful so many people ask me when I have this on so highly re rec um, highly recommend this color for you guys and then next I will talk about uh, top coat and base coat and stuff like that um, I don't really have what the one I really show you because um, during the move, I don't know where I put half of my um, stuff, so I can't really find it, or I probably toss it out if it's dried up and stuff like that. But the first thing I want to talk about is Shashvi. This is the brand Shashvi, and I get this at um, CVS or Nail Supplies. Um, this, if you get it at CVS, it comes in two pack. Um, it's coming two in one pack. It's um, the base coat and top coat. And I love, love, love um, the base coat and top coat. It does the base coat does a job to me. Any base coat, as long as a base coat, it's good. But I, I happen to get a top coat. And they have the base coat, but I, I, I love the base coat as well. The top coat is just, <coughs> excuse me, amazing. I love, love the top coat. It's dry really quickly. But one downfall about this: after a while, you having this, um, it will dry up. It will get, uh, uh clumpy and just thickening so now 
for this one right here I can't use anymore even though I still have this much left I can't use anymore it's uh, really thick now you can put uh, thinner if you guys don't know what thinner is it helps to um, make your nail polish um, runny and uh, new again is you can just put in that kind of term but um, I don't like that so this is probably tossed in the garbage but I'm just show I'm just showing you guys Chesh are or one of my favorite um, brand of top coat and base coat and then the next um, on the list of top coat is my all-time favorite would be out the door that's what it called out the door top coat and I don't have that like I said I can't find it. I don't know what the heck it goes sorry if the sun is like my the lighting is getting crazy because I'm using natural sunlight and oh my god I have like tons of light in here but anywho um, I love out the door you can get it at um, the only store I seen that actually have it is uh, Christmas Tree Shop. I don't know if you guys have that store around you, but other than that, I don't see it in like a drugstore um, at all. And usually, where I get mine is at the nail supply store. So if you guys can order them online, I love Low Outdoor. It's very very quick. It dry very fast, and it. It, I just love it because I hate I love getting my nails painted I love doing my nails but the fact of waiting for it to dry kills me every time so definitely I don't like that but highly recommend Shesh V and um, Out the Door sorry I keep on looking thinking somebody's driving by but I love love those two brands a lot okay and the next one I will talk about is this is the one I've been using currently um, currently this is the one I've been using um, every time I paint my nails now since I don't know where my CSV base coat go so this is the one I pick up it's by SC and this is uh, no chips ahead this is like a base coat it's very thin compared to um, any base coat that I use um, especially the CSV one this one is very liquidy but it does the job I don't see my nail chip um, as fast or maybe because I usually nail polish doesn't chip on me unless like the nail polish is really crappy but usually it doesn't but um, regardless I always use a base coat and this is by um, Etsy so um, if you guys can't find um, any base coat I highly recommend this and if your nails always chip uh, check this out alright um, and then the next one I show you is uh, what I have on my nails um, in the next video that you see and this is what I have on my nails right now and I just love it and this is by the brand of Essie and this is um, uh, called Blanc so I guess it's just is this white nail polish so any white nail polish does the job uh, I love this um, it's just a really starched white color it's by Essie and then the next one is also by Essie. As you can tell, I do like Essie a lot, but I'll tell you wh why I like Essie um, in a minute. And this is their Lux Effect Top Coat, um, Glitter Top Coat, and it's in the shine of the times. So that is what I have on my nails in the next video so you guys can see. Alright, enough about nail polish um, that I'm showing you. I'm going to tell you uh, my two top favorite uh, nail polish that I... Um, adore the brand I adore. I love OPI. I'm an all time um, OPI lover. I just love the brand. Their polishes are always creamy, always nice. I have majority of um, OPI. I don't buy a lot of OPI because um, our, our family owns a nail salon, so uh, I can always have access to um, get OPI anytime I want at my mom's store. So I don't really buy a lot of OPI. Um, because we use um, at sorry if I keep on saying a lot of um, oh my god I think that's gonna be my worst for the day oh I hate that okay so as you can tell the nail polish rack in the back is um, built by me and Sunny we built this when we moved to into our new place and I just absolutely love it I will have another video talking about just my nail polish uh, my nail polish rack and where I um, bought the supplies from and how um, I built it so that will be in separate videos so just answer your guys question because you guys thought that I bought this um, no this probably hold over um, closely 200 nail polish if I actually wanted to because I still have a lot of space on top um, so that is it and then the next thing I want to talk about is um, uh, how I do my nails 
for particular, if you're getting your nails done at a store, you do a lot of things, especially you file them, you shape them, and then you cut the cuticles, make you cut down your nails. Um, in the videos, I don't really explain a lot. In the next video, I really don't explain a lot because I just want to jump in to show you guys how I do my nails. But you will see that I, do, I um, don't cut my cuticles at all because to me this uh, I don't like the fat cutting my cuticles because it grow out very fast and I recommend that to other people as well because the more you cut the more it will grow out so I never cut my cuticles the only thing if I ever cut is the side of my fingernails if I have dead skin that's pretty much it or else I don't cut my cuticles when I file them down um, I, my nails are very strong, very healthy in the first place. I have a very um, healthy hair and nails, so that's I love about it. I used to wear fake nails a lot. When I say fake nails, is I wear pink and white so much. If you watch my old, old videos, I always wear pink and white because it's just like... If I have... Um, <coughs> excuse me. If I have um, a choice to put a set on, it will be pink and white because it's very natural, very... Um, you know, I just love it. It's classic and just make your nails look um, presentable even after a long period of time. So I love that. But even after putting fake nails on for a while, when I take it off and regrow my nails, it's still in the best condition. So I love that about my nails. My nails can grow very long if I wanted to, but I usually keep it on this length, uh, medium length, because uh, if my nails grow out any longer, it will curve in on, I, on the edges. Alright, so when I say I don't cut my cuticles, it's because when after I file them, I will um, definitely buffer them. By when you buffer their nails, the dead skin come off um, um, from your cuticles as well. So that's what I love about it. And very, very important that you need to um, buffer your nails uh, after you file them because you want it to be um, a clean edges and soft and stuff and so you won't scratch yourself. And the fact that you, if you always wear nail polishes, I highly recommend buffering it because it will um, take up all the stain. If your if your nails always get stained by uh, nail polishes, I highly recommend you need to buffer it because it will take off all the stain and the yellowness from your um, old previous nail polish. So that's a very highly recommended. So make sure you guys do that. And always important to protect your nails. Base coat is just like a protection. It's just like a primer before you put on a foundation. And uh, I think I'm pretty much cl uh, done with explaining my nails. And what else? Am I missing anything else? Um, if I miss anything else, it will be in the next nails um, segment. But for now, I am officially done with this video. I hope um, all this, like my video, is very informative for you guys. I try to explain because I have so many of you guys request. It's a highly requested videos um, about how I do my nails and how I keep them so clean, so strong, and stuff like that. And um, about my nail polish, that will be in the next uh, segment. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys more like more videos like this, um, please leave a comment down below and like this video so that I know that you guys enjoy watching this type of videos. All right. So for those of you who want to see how I do my nail, make sure you um, stay tuned to the next uh, nail segment, which I already have it already. I will post it up in a few days after posting up this video. Other than that, enjoy your weekend. Have a wonderful. Uh, day it's a beautiful day today so I can't wait and I'll see you guys in my next video bye